Greetings. We're at San Jacinto Mall. Out here in the parking lot. Today is May 25th, 2022. I noticed this building here had some activity going on. There's a uh, few workers over there you can see and they have a white barricade. That white barricade shows that they're having a um, an asbestos abatement project going on here. And there's all kinds of things going wrong. All of those men over there that I can see from here have their half mask respirators around their neck. So they're inside the area. And I wanna take you around to the other side. Here's a another worker right here with his mask around his face. And uh, let's take a look. You can see some of the insulation laying there on the porch by the door and by the way look how I can walk right up to it if I want to there's no barricade to prevent me from walking right up into the asbestos abatement area it should be out of ways from the building I don't know exactly how far but uh, far enough so that they can conduct monitoring and uh, show that there's uh no exposure so you can see I don't know if you can see that that says asbestos see that yeah so we'll come around here on this side of the building and uh, you're gonna see a blue dumpster and they look how they got their blue dumpster where they're throwing all the contaminated area into look at the barricade around that think that's effective let's just wrap a barricade around the actual dumpster hmm great job I don't know who's running this project but they're not doing a good job they're exposing people to asbestos their workers and they're also potentially exposing the public uh, so and another thing that I don't see here as I walk around this building. You can see that there's some activity going on on the inside here too. Well, I see they're wearing some uh, respirators in there. But I wanna show you something else. They've got uh, these two connexes I don't see any utilities connected to them so I was looking for a decontamination trailer a place for these guys to clean up now perhaps that's in the inside of the contaminated area because they may have water running in there but this doesn't appear to be a decontamination area shouldn't they have a place for these workers to be decontaminated before they get in their cars and drive off toward their home and expose their car to contamination if they haven't been cleaned up we got a problem I think this is not being run correctly and I'm going to see if I can offer my assistance on this so that's about it for now looks like they've pretty much finished with this but they're just not doing a very good job. I suspect that this mall was, by the way, this mall was opened up in 1981. And I suspect that if there's asbestos out here, there's probably asbestos on the inside as well. And that's gonna be a problem. So anyway, that's where we're at.